Alright everybody, alrighty. Hey, this is Jackrabbit here with another Jackrabbit's production. And this time I'm going to be going over the Super Power, Power Rangers Dino Charge Dino Supercharge line and Kylo Zord. Now I did this review once with Frugal Frog and the video kinda had too many mess ups in it. And I'm lazy I, and I don't know how to edit right, so I can't really edit it, so so I had to reshoot. I love reshooting. All right, well let's go with the charger real quick, just so we can get it out of the way. Here it is. Like we typically have been getting with the. Oopsies! I gotta pick that up. I knocked some stuff over. With Dino Charge Super Line, there's a QR code which does not work in the morpher in the app yet. Diane. And Kylo Source. And Kylo for short. Alright. Here's his box. Uh, I like the box. I like the background on it. It looks awesome. I mean. Uh, definitely looks like it fits where the Kylo is at in the ship. Yeah, and then it has the super. Sorry, I'm having to put my Megazord back together because it fell apart. Okay. Alright, so you got Enkylo there. You got a picture of Enkylo there. You got Enkylo Zord with Charger. Charger unlocks battle mode, which I will have to show off later. That's where the charger would be. Again, as I said, nice background. Typical logos. There's a picture of Tyler and his Dino Supercharge mode, which kind of looks like Dino Drive mode, but um, with um, with more padding, more armor. Hopefully, they address that in the show. Well, maybe they're gonna call that Dino Super Drive mode. Which, if they do, would be kind of retarded. I kind of like what they call the, uh... I think they're going to call it Super Drive, where he had... Carnival Mode from Cure Jar. I think they should just call it Carnival Mode, just because it looks cool. Alright, and now we're here. It talks about the charger with the app, and all the ways you can use it. Yes, I do own the Dino Charge Morpher. Alright. Again, shows what it does in the Morpher. There's a nice promo art there. All those arts that are out in this line. Which I already have all the ones I want, so I don't have to worry about that. Again, mention the Megazord, which I just had to fix. Yeah, I'm right. Yep, again, all about the charges you can collect. I have almost all the ones I want. That's basically the box. So let's get that out of the way. Let's go over the main attraction here, and Kylo, which I really like. Now he's now when it comes to his legs, he has the same mold as yes, hold on as um as Stego does. Stego and uh, tri Triceratops. I cannot talk today. Ugh. I apologize, but I cannot talk today. All right. So, he's a gimmick from the show. Now, he's in the show. He shows up. He shows up first in When Sleeping Zord Lie. Now, his ranger has yet to appear. But he has appeared. He appeared first in Sleeping Zord Lie, as I said. But I like him. I mean, he's been kind of controlled by Shelby, which I think is awesome because I really like Shelby. But, okay. Here we go. And Kyle Lazord. All right, I gotta do this. All right, I'm gonna show you what. Show, now I'm gonna show off what the charger does. But all right, his legs can move, and all that fun stuff. So he, you can have some posability with him. But stick the charger in his mouth. I gotta move my hand. Hold on, it's hammer time. Down, 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 down. 
It's hammer time. Now, there's actually an interesting thing about this guy, actually. And that is, I'll show you off when he gets to his Megazord. Commands with the Megazord, which I'm just about to do now. But he's very nice. I mean, I like him. Even by himself, as a display Zord, he looks really good. He is kind of tight going on to the Megazord. I'm not sure why that is. Maybe it's just his head sculpt. I think it's just his head sculpt. Oi. Get him ready. Zoop. 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 That's all you gotta do. Put this on his arm. There you go. There we go. He's on. He looks really nice. An Ankyla Trianclio formation. And what's really cool about this guy is that the Kyuger version, the Japanese version, could not do. You can actually take off his back piece here and give it to the other hand. On his hand, I prefer to put it in the other hand. So that way you can kind of have a dual uh, threat here. So it looks really good. I mean, definitely a Zorda. I definitely say pick his... If you could find them still. Sorry, my Disney Infinity figures are back there. I've got to find a spot for them. Um, if you could find him still. I don't know if he's still in circulation or not. If you could find him in retail, buy him up. He's awesome sword. Definitely worth picking up. I paid retail price 15 bucks for him. Not bad. Maybe I paid a little less because I got him on sale. I'm not sure. I can't remember. But overall, I didn't spend in godly. Don't expect you to spend in godly. This has been a... But overall, very nice addition to the line. Definitely will be picking up more Zords as they come out. I think the only thing else that's out is Spino and Black T-Rex. I've got you got lines on picking them up. I don't know if I'm going to keep the Black T-Rex or sell it. I'll let you guys know. Maybe I'll do a giveaway with it. I don't know. Spice up the channel a bit. Maybe I'll do a giveaway. You know what? I might do a giveaway. I don't know yet. All the time. I'll keep you guys posted. If I start doing any kind of giveaways or anything, I'll keep, I'll keep you guys low. It'll probably be either a Toys R Us gift card of some kind or something. I'll figure something out eventually. But, in order for that, I've got rules. A, you gotta be a subscriber, and B, you gotta start commenting on my videos in order to win anything. But, alright. And we got Beetleborgs uh, day, days coming up. Soon, I don't know. Um, think, I wanna try to get a few, the rest of my Dino Charge stuff done before I do the uh, Beetleborgs week. But I got some Beetleborg, uh, Beetleborg days, I'm gonna call them. Um, because I got some Beetleborg stuff I need to review. Because I've ha I have it. I just haven't reviewed it. So I'm going to let you guys know. This has been Jackrabbit Productions. As always, I'm Jackrabbit. And I'm hopping right on.